Hi, in this video, we are going to see about a MATLAB project which is entitled as Classification of Path Walls Using Convolutional Neural Network Model, which is an IEEE 2023 conference paper. So the base paper title is Classification of Path Walls Using Convolutional Neural Network Model, a Transfer Learning Approach Using Inception resnet v2 so before seeing the execution of the project let me brief about this project so we all know that the road transportation is increasing day by day due to the usage of the number of vehicles and ease of the getting the cars and bikes kinds of thing but we know that in uh, countries like India and several countries uh, the road conditions are very bad so we need to detect the road conditions we are going to approach we make a scientific approach using the deep learning model so here in the base paper the authors have classified the path walls using the convolutional neural network model using the inception resnet v2 transfer learning based convolution neural network model is used so here they achieved the accuracy of 94.42 percentage so now we are not going to use the same as mentioned in the base paper so we are going to see about our proposed model so here in the proposed model we are going to use google net architecture and we are going to implement using matlab so we have achieved the accuracy of about 98 percentage so which is more than the existing system that is the base paper so now we are considering the existing system as the base paper model and we are going to propose our proposed system as our proposed model so here you can see in the proposed apps architecture so sorry the proposed abstract about the classification of path walls using convolutional neural where we have used google net architecture and implemented in matlab so here we are going to make the classification into three types that is large path wall small path wall and normal road so these are the three classification that we are going to use using the google net architecture and we have achieved 98 percentage of the accuracy of it so here you can see the objective the object main objective is to develop an efficient deep learning framework capable of accurately detecting the categorized different types of path tools in the images so here you can see the, the existing system so as i intimated so we are considering the base paper console inception resnet v2 as the existing system and these are the about the existing system and you can see about the disadvantage of the existing system which contains about the limited accuracy generalization challenges training data bias high computation resources complexity and maintenance time consuming training limited expandability and resource intensive de deployment uh, model interpolity so these are the disadvantages of the existing system and this is about the proposed system that we have uh, discussed about the google architecture i'm not going to tell each and everything as it takes more in this video and the length of the video will go more so let me short on by telling only the basic things and these are the advantages of the proposed system and uh, coming to the system architecture you can see the data set images uh, is giving the training process using the google net and trained model has been developed and here in the testing process you can see about the input images and pre-processing is been done and classification is google net, google net architecture is done and they classified as normal road or large path hole or small path hole so this is all the modules of the project and here you can see the system archi system requirements hardware and software requirements and as i mentioned we have developed this in matlab and the tool that we have used is matlab or 2021a and this is the reference of the project that we have used in the base paper so now let me show you about the data set part so here in the data set you can see the three classes large path hole normal road and small path hole so just if you go to the normal path holes these are all the images that we have trained up with for the large path hole images so these are the few images from the data set and let me move to the normal road images so these are the normal road images which we use for the data set part and final class is small path hole so here you can see this these are all the small path holes 
so now let us execute the project so first you go to the source code location this is the full coding this is the source code location just copy the location now open the matlab or 2021a so now in the address bar you can paste this location and click enter so now you can see the project coding is being loaded in the left side panel so now you select the final dot m and right click it and then click run so now you can see the gui which contains the project title classification of path holes using convolutional neural network so first thing is like you need to uh, give the input uh, image so first select this read test image and select just if you click this button it will open the pick up an image so you can just go to the test images folder so we have given few images you can also go to the training uh, data set also so um, I'm, I'm going to the test images part and you can select any images that you wanted to test so let me select this image randomly and this is the image that we have given test image that is been vectorized here and let me go to the next process that is the pre-processing module so just click the pre-processing so you can see the pre-processed image that is resized image here and next comes the important part that is classification so just if you click the classification part um, after few seconds you can uh, see the message of loading that is trained network model was loaded message and click ok so now we have already developed the model and the developed model is called and it is been classified and it is displayed the result as large path hole so if you wanted to check with some other image you can close and do it or you can just man do it in this way also just let me go to the path images and let me select some uh, normal image so this is the test image that i have given so just if you give pre-processing you can see the resized image and if you give classification the pre the network time model was being loaded and you can see that then it is being classified as normal road so here you can see the classified image as normal road so now let me go to the read images and let me select uh, the other class that is small so let me select this one this image and then click pre-processing you can see the pre-processed image and we click the classification and now you can see the tri network model is being called and here you can see it is classified as small path hole so now this time i'll go into the data set part and let me select some other image uh, other than that that we have given right now so now let me go into the large path hole folder and let me select an image this image and click uh, pre-processing you can see the pre-processed image and click the classification and uh, you can see the classified result as large path hole so let me go to the test image and let me go to the data set folder right now i'll go to the small path hole and let me select uh, image this one and give pre-processing and you give classification now you can see it is classified as small path tool so in this way you can select the other images and with with the, this available in the test folder and also in the data set folder so uh, you, uh, as it takes more time i am not going to show with all the images you can check with other cases now let me go to the final part that is the performance analysis part so just click the performance analysis part so it takes some time for performance analysis part please wait till that so here you can see the process so you need to wait for a few minutes or seconds according to your system configuration so it makes some calculations as mentioned in the module part so all these calculations will be made for the accuracy error rate recall value specificity of score all those things so it takes some time for detecting that uh, predicting the values of the performance analysis parameter so now you can see uh, it is generated few images but you need to wait so you need to wait till this completed message is shown in the window so just click ok so in the console you can let me go and show you in the console part you can see all this calculations has been made and it has finished so 
here you can see the total instances confusion matrix multi-class confusion matrix output all those details. so now let us go to the GUI part and show you so here you can see first it is like figure one so these are all the few images taken with the predicted score so here you can see normal uh, road with 100 percentage predicted so normal road with 98 small path hole is predicted for 99 percentage large path hole. large path hole is predicted for the 99 percentage large path hole predicted for the 93 percentage so now here in the uh, each and every image you can see some uh, functionalities like you can save this image or you can zoom in so you can select this zoom in option and you can uh, if you select zoom in you can see it is zooming in right now or you can zoom out if you just click the home it will come back to the normal stage so you can move the image from by using this hand tool tip so come back by clicking the home page in this way you can check for all the images which have has been here with the normal road small path hole and raj path hole with the predicted score of it so next uh, thing is like confusion matrix so here confusion matrix is being plotted with the three classes that is large path hole normal road small path hole with the true and the predicted label that is output class and the target class of it and final is the performance analysis parameter of our google net architecture which we have developed so here you can see the accuracy that we have achieved is 97.84 which is 98 percentage and error it is 0 0.0216 precision is 0 0.9777 specificity is 0 0.9894 sensitivity is 0 0.9776 f1 score is 0 0.9 776 MCC is 0 0.967 if you wanted to save this you can also save this as a image so let me save it in the desktop as um, performance and let me save it as uh, image format as BMP and save it so let me close this and here this confusion matrix also you can save like a king by save as or save anything so let me select in the CF let me name a CF let me close this part so as I said you can also save all these uh, things as a test let me save it as says test here you can see the things that we have uh, saved that is performance analysis as image and confusion matrix part that image so So in this way you can find the classification of path words using the convolutional neural networks and this is all about the project classification of path words using convolutional neural network model using MATLAB and thank you for watching.